530, a show of unity in Middleborough. Good evening and thank you for joining us. I'm Anaritis Rodriguez. I'm Paula Eben. Over the weekend, police found some hateful words spray painted on the high school. As WBZ's Christina Hager shows us, students are angry all of this happened. Even though the messages are covered up, Middleborough high school students knew the words underneath the white paper don't belong here. I'm honestly disgusted from this. They pay $100 million for this school and someone comes there and treats it like this. I don't agree with it at all. I think it's disgusting. Security cameras captured pictures of two disguised people Saturday. Police say they vandalized the building with hateful language and imagery, including a swastika. The superintendent calling it vulgar and threatening. The high school principal said there was a direct threat against me. Any school, any place where the kids feel like they're safe and stuff like that, they should not be uh, in a situation that they're exposed to graffiti or slander or, or especially swatch stickers. Come on. There's a lot of rumors about who it could have been, but I can't believe any of them. I just didn't really expect it from anybody here at Middleborough because that's not what our community is like. That's sad. I mean, that's the harsh reality. School committee chairman Rich Young says the sooner police get to these suspects, the better. You know, they did something wrong, so you want to give lessons to kids that this, this can't happen, whether it's a, a prank or a silly act or it's something more. There's responsibility for things that you do. In response, some students wore school colors today, orange and black, in a show of unity. And some parents stood out here with signs supporting the principal. Meantime, police are asking anyone with information to give them a call. In Middleborough, Christina Hager, WBZ News.